the biggest shit talker in Warframe got to this point. You faced him every single time and even in his ultimate defeat, he never seems to learn how to be quiet. Would you ever feel pity if you experienced the sight of a single head on a machine floating on the sky? Would you be scared to your knees? Would you be shaken? Terrified? Or would you take a limp and kill with fire? Well, today on Warframe Explain, we will be digging through the heart of the Grenier to find what was hidden to unearth the very questionable calamity within Warframe. So today we will be taking a much closer look at the ascension of Council of Vahek. It was during the periodical visits to the Grenier base. All the soldiers will be in attendance and most important of all, the queens will be there. This was the perfect time for the young hopeful and his medical partner to impress the queens. Tonight, they will drain Kuva from the skulls of great enemies and become one with the throne in the throne's favor. Oh yes, the knight's proposal will make Vahex name the one to remember and perhaps give him a face only a mother could love. His vision was to supply the queens with limitless resources, no need to waste resources or reason to wait for reinforcement. The Grenier will have the ghouls, a cannibalistic and highly mutated clone the ones who are bred and created to execute and also complete combat objectives when activated and when commanded. He proposed the literal and the ultimate slipper agents for the Grenier, something that will bolster and increase the power and the reach of the Empire. But little did Counselor Heck know that he was playing into Dr. Tengu's hand. Dr. Tengu, which happened to be his right hand man. While the Grenier remains a formidable force and a well-matched adversary, there is one thing that matters more than anything and that is Ascension. Most Grenier believe that Ascension will bring greatness and strength, and whichever way one may attempt, everything ends at the foot of the Grenier Quins. This is the night they both become the men they are meant to be. Dr. Tengus, his most trusted, stood there while the crowd ridiculed and laughed at Counselor Heck. He stood there while his attempt at pleasantries failed, but mostly he had agreed to back his proposal in attempts to reach greatness. But the result was quite different, very different from what anyone would anticipate. Before Vahek could complete and finish his presentation of the ghouls, before he could complete his offer of the ghouls to the queens, Dr. Tengu pushed the aspiring counselor and launched him into the pit of ghouls. Plate by plate, they crushed every single armor upon him. Within seconds, they began to scathe him out of mediocrity. Within minutes, they tore his cloned flesh. Limb by limb, they pierced the sections of his skin. And like vampires, they drained his blood, tore his flesh, ate him, one after each other, layer after layer. And in pain and suffering, the soldiers, Dr. Tengu and the Queen watched as poor Vahek is completely in agony, as he lay there being torn apart alive and in pain. The ghouls are almost complete with their job. They separated every joint, piercing between bone and marrow. The once proclaimed aristocrat is now gone. All his fancy colors, fancy clothing, amazing poise, his well-designed attitude, everything down in the pit of ghouls. Well, so it was assumed. Blessed by the scepter of the Quins, Dr. Tengus was ordered to assemble Counselor Heck. He was ordered to create him and put him back together with metal parts and a different form of cybernetics. Then the Counselor awoke from his operation, picked up a mirror, looked at himself, looked at the eye, looked at his face, what was left of him. He is now a mixture of flesh and machine. He beholds himself and admired the man that he is meant to be. He busted out in fury, yelled, and became the beautiful face that we all see today. And as for Dr. Tengus, no one really knows the fate and the survival of this doctor. But there is, of course, one single question that still baffles most. Was the doctor's attempt on Vahek's life genuine? Or was it a combined effort or a combined attempt or a combined plan that will end up sealing his fate? Let me know what you think down below. And if you enjoyed this video, feel free to leave a thumbs up. If you would love to see more on this channel, go ahead and subscribe to Dad Fuye. And as always, 
It is DA signing out. I'll see you guys in the next one.